For me, Art Unbound is, a, is one of those fun projects. Some of the materials that come to us are too damaged to sell, and they go to the recycler. Art Unbound, it's all about recycling. Or what if we could give these uh, materials a chance at a new life as art? So to take these pieces of recycled material and turn them into magical art pieces is what this show is all about. It'll be a gallery event from October 22nd to November 21st. And then at the very end, there will be an art auction. The uh, event on the, on the 21st is uh, $50 and uh, those are available if you contact the library, the Friends of the Library. They're really going to wow Columbus. My name is, yeah. so my name is Rob Jones, and I do, I would say, kind of like a pop art, folk art kind of thing. Just kind of found objects, usually musicians, sometimes dinosaurs, sometimes animals, you know, whatever the mood, you know, whatever the mood hits. Do you have any big influences? A uh, big influence is this guy named Dan Dalton out of Portland, Oregon, and um, Robert Rauschenberg, Francis Bacon, Basquiat. Those are kind of the big ones. And then, of course, blues. The blues is a huge one. Do you, do you have any books uh, beside your bed, on your bed stand? Um, Henry David Thoreau's Walden is what I'm reading right now. And then um, John Dewey is... Uh, art and education or something like that so some heavy stuff and uh, do you have any um, who, are you, who are your favorite authors my favorite authors are the beat poets I like Kerouac and like uh, Kowski Richard Brodigan is a big favorite and an all-time favorite is Lou Welch and of course I love the children's books you know Maurice Sendak um, who is Ezra Jack Heats um, Charlie Harper all kinds of those those guys, those are my favorites. Is there a literary figure that you most connect to? Yeah, kind of like like Lou Welch. And yeah, actually, the beat poets in general. Just, the, I mean, the respect for nature, and of course, the love of music and just jazz and the blues and all that kind of stuff. I kind of try to filter all that stuff into my paintings. Rob, would you tell me a little about, bit about the work you created for Unbound? Well, I wasn't too sure what I was going to do, but then I based it off the books that I found. I found a lot of books on dinosaurs and animals, and then the clincher was I found a book of poetry by Captain Beefheart. And I love Beefheart's music and just the blues, and so I researched him a little bit, and I found out that when he was a kid, he was really into making artwork about animals, and especially dinosaurs. So that whole, that kind of just tied everything together. And then I found out he had a song, listened to a song called the Smithsonian Institute Blues, which is all about dinosaurs. So that kind of set the tone for the pieces that I'm making for the show. So yeah, I'm excited. <laughs>